So this is just a little circuit. Three exercises, we're going through incline bench press, then we're gonna go onto a side lateral, and then we finish off on the rows. So there was three exercises involved in this circuit. As I said, it was the decline bench press and the side laterals with the cables. So we're onto the last of the exercise. So those two were before, but I didn't get the footage up. So this is a high row, obviously me standing to fire the core up, and then this is the seated version, which obviously doesn't fire the core. So you've got the two that you can choose between two. So I hope you enjoy this little circuit. There are three circuits on this video today. So uh, pace yourselves and um, give it a go. So a couple of different variations there. Floor standing. When you're standing, you find that hits the core a little bit more. Where you're seated, you don't need to stabilise. So a little fast circuit, four sets. So on to circuit two. This is the bench press followed by a single arm row and uh, on this one I've just obviously done the flat bench I've kept trying to keep to my compound movements for the chest so the flat bench hitting the 12 reps remember this is four rounds on this circuit so the second circuit is four rounds and then we're going to go on to a single arm cable row now I'm using this now because same again this does fire your core up because you need to stabilize obviously keeping your feet firmly on the floor making sure that you're pushing your weight through your heels not your toes because if you push through the toes this will just fire the little muscle that sits under the shin the tibialis anterior and we're going to make sure all i'm trying to do is i'm actually keeping my head down a little bit so i can squeeze and contract through my shoulder blades and also i'm supporting through my knee as you can see there so i'm getting a little bit of twist just a bit like a dumbbell row so imagine you're on a bench doing a dumbbell row and then we're going to go straight into one of my favourites, an upright row with a cable. But as you can see, I'm keeping my hands away from my body a little bit, not dragging it up. I just feel this gives a little bit more thickness, a three-dimensional look on the trapezius. And on to our third and final circuit. This is just a lap pull down. I've reversed myself around this time giving myself a curved bar but it's not a ridiculously wide curved bar so it gives me real nice contraction same again pulling and squeezing the rhomboids and the scapulars together and then uh, I'm just going to give you a different view so you can see from the front as well I like this one because you do same again have to work a little bit more to keep your body weight down uh, so don't go silly heavy so your bum lifts off and then uh, I've bumped into a couple of guys that I've thrown into the workout as well oh, mate. 15 come on that's it, easy. Ten more. One, two, three. Good man. Come on. Four. Push. Keep your chest up. Five. Five more. Come on. Push. And again. Last two. Last two. One more. Good man. Lovely. Look at that. Step on your 